Okay, how do you feel first of all? I feel pretty good. Uh, excited about the game. How's the trip been so far? All the festivities? Yeah, it's been a lot of fun. Um, you know, traveling in LA with the, my teammates, having fun, you know, experiencing the life. It's been pretty cool. What's been the highlight thus far? Probably Disneyland. Uh, everything else has been pretty cool as well. Did you watch any of the bowl games yesterday? I watched the first half of the Clemson Notre Dame game and I turned it off. Uh, I didn't watch much of the Alabama game, but uh, what did you take away from it? Anything? <laughs> <laughs> um, I thought we should have been in it, but uh, you know, we'll take it out on Washington. And what does that mean, taking it out on Washington? What, what, what would you say would be justification in a win or a victory, a big victory or what? Uh, I can't tell you, just want to win the game, sir. Yeah, uh, you know, athletic group. And you got two All Americans in the back end. You know, they do a lot of, you know, a lot of stuff in the secondary, and uh, you know, they do it really well. They're like top five pass defense in the country, and um, you know, I'm excited for the challenge. What is, what is the main challenge trying to navigate through that secondary for you? Uh, biggest thing is knowing situations, um, knowing when you have to take a shot, when you have to take the ball down, um, knowing certain coverages for certain looks. Picking up protections and um, you know just executing, you know completing the ball when it needs to be completed and moving the ball down the field, uh, probably the biggest challenge for them. Has there been any backfield that you face that's similar to Washington? Yeah, um, kind of like uh, Northwestern, keep stuff in front of them, make you have to uh, play perfect football, and um, I feel like they do a really good job with that. Yeah, of course. Uh, you know, it's, it's a lot of people's last game. Coach Myers last game, seniors last game. So uh, everybody just wants to go out there on the right note and have fun. Most importantly, and um, just giving it all, all when we play uh, Washington on the first. Is it a little different? Uh, maybe wearing shorts out today rather than Columbus. No, yeah, definitely. Well, it's a lot better here than it is in Ohio. But you know, LA is definitely a great place. I'm glad we were able to play in the Rose Bowl, and um, you know, couldn't ask for more. Yeah, my parents and family came in yesterday. With this uh, being Urban Meyer's last game, has he been a little more sentimental at all in uh, the practices you've had so far? Yeah, definitely just, uh, you know, being in the moment, winning the moment, uh, what we always preach, and uh, to his final way to win the game. And um, he definitely has been uh, very personable since uh, he knows it's his last game. And, um, Really excited for his opportunity to go out with the win and his favorite bowl game of all time. And, uh, you know, it was the last game as a coach, so I know it's emotional for him. You notice any difference from uh, Coach Day? Any difference in practice? Uh, you know, a little more vocal? Uh, maybe a little bit, but, uh, you know, Coach Myers is the coach, so Coach Day knows that. But uh, Coach Day always does a great job coaching us, and, you know, he's always vocal, hands on with us as an offense. And um, he's just, you know, getting used to the defense now, so uh, he's just getting used to everybody. Um, I won't say it was pressure during the season to, to, to fill the shoes of Cardell and JT. Um, definitely during the spring, it was just trying to figure out how to, to not fill the void, but learn how to, to help out with the loss of JT as a leader. And um, just learning how to be able to take over for an offense when I haven't played or started in like two years. So uh, just trying to figure out uh, how to be the guy again. So um, that's just probably the biggest uh, challenge for me. Is that really tough for you? It was, it was a challenge, uh, definitely, uh, during spring ball and in camp, and um, trying to figure out um, you know, my voice on the team. But uh, once I figured it out, I feel like I you know, took it and ran with it. Dwayne, how do you feel like your leadership has grown uh, throughout the season, from your first start to now that you played a full season of college football? Uh, I think the biggest thing is just trust. Um, you know, you just can't grab a guy by his face mask and yell at him if you haven't earned anybody's trust yet. So, um, of course, I had some trust from playing in the Michigan game last year, so people knew that I could play. But uh, just being able to show game in and game out that I can ball, just, you know, let guys, you know, 
come around me. And uh, as far as like the last four or five games, I just felt like I, you know, I had that uh, vocal leadership that I felt like I needed to be. And uh, you know, it's been getting better every game. Being a Heisman finalist, how does that inspire you even more during this game? Oh, uh, for sure. Uh, you know, didn't get in the didn't get in the playoffs and uh, didn't win the Heisman, so it is at fuels on my fire. Um, honestly, just want to go out there and give him my best shot and um, leave it all on the field. What would you say to your fan, the Ohio fans that are coming to support the game? Well, it's gonna be on, it's gonna be a show, and uh, you know, Buckeye Nation travels well, so we're gonna give it give it our best shot. Looking forward to seeing all the red jerseys in the stands, and um, you know, thankful for all those fans that watch us and support us. Any quarterbacks that you try to emulate or who inspired you as you were growing up? I like a lot of quarterbacks. I feel like I take uh, certain parts of everybody's game. Uh, growing up, I loved like uh, I loved Drew Brees, love Aaron Rodgers, love Tom Brady, you know Roethlisberger, and now it's more uh, like Watson and, and Newton and uh, still Rodgers and Brees, but um, just taking the accuracy of you know Drew Brees or uh, pocket mobility of Aaron Rodgers or you know, leadership of, of a Drew Brees or whatever, just trying to figure out how I can add everybody's game to my own.